Yo, what's going on, guys? Chaos. Um, back with the third map in the scrim. Um, I skipped Fuel Depot. Uh, I might come back and post it up tomorrow or the next day or whatever. But uh, I was just watching it, and um, honestly, it, I didn't feel like it was worth uploading. So, I don't know. You guys let me know. Like, because not only do I get shit on, but um, it, it kind of gets boring at times. Anyway, <clears throat> we're on gridlock. Um, and I take cover on boom car over here. You can see we don't really see anybody at, at boom, but we then I notice the guy moves up. I tell one shot to go on the flank. Um, he gets on the flank, but he moves up with a shotgun, even though I prefer him to, you know, to lantern. But we end up getting him down anyway, and I pick up boom shot. Uh, swag kills one in the tower. I take a shot, but, um, they already, um, pushed him out of the tower right as I shot the boom shot, and, uh, Chubbs moved up and took, took my boom, but, uh, he only got down, so I'm just stuck with negative one points for the first round, but no big deal, we're up 1-0, you know, every one of us are alive, you know, nine times out of ten in scrims when there's one guy left and there's four people, there's some sort of team firing going on because no one takes online scrims that seriously anymore. Whatever, again, I, uh, I'm moving all over to, um, to Moonclaw again, I don't see anybody whatsoever, so I look up at the tower and um, to try and get across um, to see if I could do any damage, but they already got the sniper, so I smoke out uh, grenades, and I want to move up quick, but I, they do have someone at, at boom. I don't really want to move up, so now their guy takes a uh, boom car. I tell one shot to move around while I'm lancering. He moves up. He ends up meleeing him in the back, and um, you hear some firing going on. One shot's getting hit from tower, but we did down the, um, down the cog, and then swag and chubs. They run tower this whole scrim. Like, they just straight shit on kids this entire scrim. And, um, so yeah, that's 2-0, two, <laughs> two guys. And I'm still stuck at negative one points because I suck at Gears of War, I guess. Um, I like Gridlock. It's, it's generally a good map. It's obviously balanced. It's, you know, completely symmetrical, except for, um... No, no, it's pretty much symmetrical. I think maybe some of the cars are a little bit off, but it is what it is. So uh, I tell one shot that I'm going to run through uh, and to go around really quick. We're going to push the guy boom, but it turns out that there isn't even a guy over here. So he picks up boom shot, and I just lay down some shots, you know, not necessarily trying to hit anything, but distract him from shooting uh, one shot as he picks up boom shot. Then I lay down some shots into the tower, but it makes me stand up and one shot standing there, so I end up shooting him a couple times in the head. Um, they just pick up nades, and um, so I go around. I don't want our team to get flanked. I, I move up on this guy, and then one shot booms him. So we kill him. He actually throws a he actually throws a boom uh, a nade up there and kills Shub. So I pick up the next frag, and now Swag is all up there by himself. But me and one shot are, right are coming up right behind him. We push them out of Snipe Tower, and our boom shot gets headshotted. I throw a nade towards the bottom of the stairs, and a guy the, their sniper jumps right on top of it. Swag picks up the boom behind me. And now I'm kind of in this 1v1, uh, these, this 1v2. Swag moves up, and uh, he boom shots the guy in the streets. Now we have the one guy in the pots. I move up like a dork, and again, uh, boom shot pretty much shits on me. Swag wants to back up. You never want to push a 1v1 in gears. It's just, you know, obviously if there's only two of you guys left, um, it's something you're going to want to do. But, you know, pushing a 1v1 kind of like I did is, isn't... It's just something that to get yourself killed and put your team at a disadvantage. If I played that a little slower, me and Swag could have got angles on him, got power weapons, cornered him, probably pushed him back into the spawn, and uh, had an easy 2v1. But now um, uh, the guy that's that's left for the cog actually picked up the, um, the sniper from the guy that I grenaded, and now they both have snipers, so they have to play it really careful. Uh, Swag kind of messes around a little bit at first. If you didn't see, he's just kind of, you know, standing out in the open, you know, blind firing around. Not taking it too seriously, but see, he um, he throws the smoke and um, tries to move up in tower, but he says, he figures it's not really worth it, so he heads over to, to um, uh, mid cars, and I, I get cameras to make sure where the sniper is because the smoke is blocking his point of view, and uh, we noticed that he was still in the tower, so Swag had a nice line of... A nice line to run straight to snipe. We told him not to shoot that, but he shot it, and he actually damaged the guy a little bit. He actually gets stuck, and he could have shot that other one, but he ended up not. Um, we tell him to play cautious. You know, you don't want to lose that last boom. He ends up rolling back, being stupid, and um, right into booms, uh, into swags boom. And um, I think that puts us at a three-one. Um, let's see. Uh, no, three-zero. My bad, guys. Um, la -di -da. Uh, anyway, so <laughs> we're back. Um, I'm 
for yeah, we run the stream strat every round. I'm sorry if this is boring, guys. I know some of my friends have watched this video and told me it's kind of boring because we either run through them or it's the same strat over and over again. But like I said in my last couple videos, like it's it's really just a pickup scrim. Nobody's like trying too hard. It's just you know, some people. I this is literally my the first time I played ge uh, gears in like six months. Um, anyway, I pick up Bloom. I run around the corner, one uh, one shots in a one v one, and uh, I end up booming the guy downing him. He picks up the kill and then Swag and Chubbs finish up the rest of the three kills in the tower, and that's it for me. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Later.